Hello everybody, it's me, it's me, it's D.A.B., and welcome back to the Earthbound LP. Well then, we've made it, uh, to the cave of the past. We are in the distant past, and we're ready to fight Gygus. So, you're gonna see me trying to avoid a lot of battles here. The truth be told, I'm not looking to fight a lot of these enemies. They're tough. Um, you know, nope, nope, nope. Three enemies at a time, not happening. I will always try to despawn one enemy at a time. I can probably take. But I will be tiptoeing my way through here a lot. Good. Yeah, let's despawn him. I can fight one of you. What do we got? Right, goes to start, man. I can deal with that. Um. Just bash him. Okay, that is not good. It's alright. Alright. It's alright. Okay. Alright. There we go. He's dead. Okay, the only one we need to heal right now is Paula. Alright, Jeff. Hit another level. That IQ doesn't matter at this point. You have fixed everything you can possibly fix. You'll be okay. Mm -mm. Quite one of you. Okay, these things are not that bad. Wait, wait. Use that bazooka. Alright. They hit hard and they can poison, but. Do it again. There. Yeah, squatter demons aren't that bad. Paula is just kind of your um. That she's who you want to keep alive. Let's heal her up. No, I don't want to talk to nobody. I want to heal Paul. Get beta this time. All right, I'll mix her out. I'm not looking to fight two things at once. Not here. Not in the cave of the past. Oh, and we're doing it. Okay, we're gonna try to run. Can we run? Uh-oh. Okay, they don't really do much. We're gonna get a PCA Star Storm. Alright, I don't really want to burn a Horn of Life, but we might have to. Run away. Alright, come on, we can do this one more time. Run away. Come on, hurry. End it, okay. Yeah, that's primarily how I'm going to be getting through here. Uh, Omega. Good. Okay, two things. Not looking for that, thank you. But yeah, the enemy, it feels like the waves never stop. You just kind of got to get through them. If you get up against two, maybe three enemies, like, try to avoid that at all costs. But if it happens, try to run. Screw it. Um, I think we can run from this fight. We good? Okay. Yeah, make that your first goal. Just try to run. Like the more you can run, the more you should. So we can get a green swirl out of that fight. All right. Let's try to run again. Okay. Yeah. That's gonna be the primary thing here. I'm just gonna try to run from these fights because I want to have as much health going into the final fight as we can. I'll take that. Thank you. I guess I'll fight. Might have to try to outrun it. See, there's a ghost of Starman. That's when I get really, really scared. I'll try it. I don't think we're always going to be able to run from these, and I'd rather not just take a PK Star Storm for no reason, so let's try. Alright, good job. He's going to hurt. It's alright. It's alright. Alright. Good job. Can you not do that? Okay, he's dead. Okay. It's, oh, that should have counted. 
Alright, wasting a horn of life on Paula. I'm just gonna go ahead and do it now, outside of battle, or inside battle. Really? Why? Get the crap out of it. So they're not very hard. Not bad. Yeah, what you're primarily trying to do here is just keep everybody alive. Ness has a shit ton of uh, PP at this point. So you really shouldn't worry too much about keeping everybody healthy. Yeah, I'm not afraid of you. Just... No, don't bash with Jeff. Use Heavy Bazooka. I should try Hungry HP so I can see what that did. Good job, Pooh. Could have used that last round, but that's alright. I will absolutely take a horn of life. Alright. Not bad. I'll take it. So, the first thing. Yeah. Yield Jeff. Yield Jeff again. <laughs> What do we got here? The legendary bat. Okay. Um, there's a very rare enemy here. First off, let me equip this bat. It's uh, the Bionic Kraken. I will never be trying to waste my time to find it. I don't think it's worth the time. They have a 1 in 128 chance of dropping the Gutsy Bat, which is the best bat for Ness. He will uh, get smash attacks almost every single time. Drop it. Okay, well, I guess it doesn't matter. There's not really any more items. Can you just walk past you? Nope. Anyway, sorry. Um, you're not even scary. The Gussie Bat will get smash attacks almost every time. It is uh, Ness's legendary weapon, like the uh, Sword of Kings or the Magic Fry Pan for Paula. It's just... It is not worth it to try and get. At least I don't think it is. Okay, let's use those few seconds of Embalm. Okay, good. First teleport. Nothing wanting to fight us here. Magic butterfly. Thank you. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and heal everybody up. Take that butterfly, thank you. And moving up. Like I said, I'll fight one thing at a time. I'm not afraid of one thing at a time. You know what? What the hell? We'll try it. Bash it. I'll, uh... Freeze it. Jeff. Bazooka. Who? You know what? Hold on. I got a better idea. I'm never gonna use this. Paula, use your bag of Dragonite. Like, let's just see what happens here. Yeah, she's gonna proceed to rip up this Kraken with us. Alright. It's gonna sting a little bit. Okay, cool. That wasn't too bad. Nice. Yeah, I was I wasn't even expecting to find the frickin' bat. But if it happened, I would have freaked out a little bit. That would have been so sick. Alright. Oh my goodness, I don't want to tangle with all that. Okay, scared off. Oh god. Oh, it would all want to fight me. Oh, we're getting the hell out of here. Run, 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 run. Thank god. Holy crap. I don't remember what that level of Starman is called. Here it is, guys. Okay, how's everybody looking? I think I healed everybody up. This is alright. Paul's alright. Jeff's okay. Yeah, Pooh, kill yourself a little bit. <laughs> you burn it, buddy. Okay. Now, if you would, give one of those caramels to Ness. Okay. Here we're at this big, creepy, pulsating cave of trail of... trail of entrails, I suppose. 
can take little side routes on it. There's no enemies that spawn in here, there's just one enemy towards the very end. Technically two. Alright guys, this is it. This is what we came all the way here for. First off... This has two, he's good. Pokey. Ness, are you surprised? It's me, Pokey. I assist only the strong and able. That's Pokey. You guys look pathetic. The Apple of Enlightenment has already made a prediction, but I won't let what the Apple of Enlightenment predicted take place. You guys will be beaten by Gygus. Gygus will be stronger, a more powerful entity than any other. Why? Because of me. I was led here by Gygus, but now I'm here. The Apple of Enlightenment couldn't predict this. Master Gygus, no. Gygus is no longer the wielder of evil. He has become the embodiment of evil itself, which he cannot control on his own. He is the evil power. Okay, first half of the fight. Or the first third, really. Um, I'm going to try and paralyze Pokey. If you can paralyze him, you'll do a shit ton of damage to him. He really won't be able to do anything. And then just drop some heavy freezes on him. Um. Should have multi the rocket at him. Who just bash him for the first turn? Yeah, Gygus can do that. It hurts. Alright, not too bad. Not too bad. It's okay. Come on, paralyze him. Come on! Okay, didn't work this first round. Not too bad. Okay, Ness, heal everybody up. Pull up! Freeze Pokey again. Jeff, shoot him with another bottle rocket. And boo! We're gonna be freezing this time. damage, good damage. Okay, he solidified for a turn, that's good. Okay, this one will knock out Paul off, but no, no it didn't, cool. That was the only alpha, I guess. So yeah, I'm not too worried, nothing bad can happen this turn to anybody else. Especially after Ness heals everybody. Just move that multi-bottle rocket. Oh, another, that yeah, was kind of weak. Okay, he's able to move. Ness, try and paralyze him again. Paula. Again. Jeff. Just shoot him this turn. Er, I'm gonna use the body of the bottle rocket. You get two of these bad boys left. Pokey. Or Pokey. Sorry, Pokey. Who? Bash Pokey. Okay, good, good. Rockin' Alpha. Not scared of Rockin' Alpha. It doesn't do jack. Uh, that's starting to get my nerves a little bit, but that's okay. Ease his ass up. Bad. Okay, he solidified. Paralyze him. Didn't work. That's okay. Okay, you know what? Screw it. We're done trying to paralyze him. Paralyzing him really puts in work. Because then he really can't do anything. He can't attack. His attacks hit really hard, but I'm not worried about him. Um, multi bottle rocket him. Who? One more freeze. By the way, in this first part of the fight, do not attack Gygus. You won't hurt him, and he has a shield that will reflect all your attacks back at you. So anything that does multi-target, just don't. Just use only single target attacks on Pokey. Alright, that's good. Alright, that first fight's over. I understand you guys are already claiming to be heroes. Well, it's a gazillion years too early for you to oppose Gygus. You must feel pretty stupid to keep fighting without even knowing what Gygus looks like. If you were to ever see Gygus, you'd be so petrified with fear. You'd never be able to run away. That's how scary it is. So do you want me to turn off the devil's machine? Well, prepare to be amazed. This is gonna kinda be a waste of turn now. So isn't this terrifying? I'm terrified too. Gygus can't think rationally anymore. 
and he isn't even aware of what he's doing now. His own mind was destroyed by his incredible power. What an almighty idiot. Yep, that's what he is. <laughs> and you, you'll be just another meal to him. Okay, uh, my multi-bottle rocket's not gonna matter. That'll put in some work, though. Yeah, that's gonna mess. Okay. PK Rock and Omega. Freeze Omega. Use that bazooka. And PK Star Storm Omega. Eight hundred fifteen. We might one round him, because we way over level before we got here. Alright, Rock and Omega. Not bad, not bad. 550. Yes. You can't grasp the true form of Gygus attack. That's PK Freeze. We need to take a turn to heal everybody. Check the bottle. The bazooka. Oh! Cool! <laughs> you must really be at the end of your rope. In this bizarre dimension, you four are, only, are the only force fighting for justice. And here you stand, waiting to be burned up with all the rest of the garbage of this universe. Ha! Huh. That's so sad I can't help but shed a tear. You know my heart is beating incredibly fast. I must be experiencing absolute terror. Do you want to scream for help here in the dark? <laughs> Why not call your mommy nest? Say, Mommy, Daddy, I'm so frightened. I think I'm gonna wet my pants. I know you have telepathy or something, so just try and call for help, you pathetically weak heroes of so-called justice. No one will help you now. <laughs> Don't worry, your pitiful suffering will be over soon. Okay, cool. Well, that cussing stopped everybody from getting hurt. Okay, that was the uh, first half of the Kygus fight. So, um... I'm gonna go ahead and call it right here. I know this was a shorter part than I expected, mainly because I got through those caves quicker than I thought I would. But that's gonna be all for this part. So thanks for watching, everybody. Until the finale. Next time. <laughs>